What's graping guys? Welcome back to Alice Madness Returns. Last time we left off uh, following the Mad Hatter. And if you're wondering, hey, by the way, what are you wearing? Why does Alice look so different? Well, uh, I finally figured out how to use the DLC that came with the game of with the Steam sale. And uh, I finally learned how to put it on for her. You have to like go into the game something code in the documents and change it up but then you get the costumes and in honor of working with the Mad Hatter we are going to be dressed as the Mad Hatter himself or herself as a costume and we got some cool special weapons we got a cleaver here and let me show you my cool octogun that's right I got an octogun in like a sh uh, whatever that is a seashell and that's pretty cool so we're gonna go over here that's pretty much all the cool things that happened uh, I whoever said hold on. There's no book so bad, but something good may be found in it. Never read Martin Farquhar Tupper's proverbial philosophy. Uh, like I was saying, and I figured out that the whole time I was wondering whether whether or not there's a previous game or a prequel to Alice Madness Returns, which there sort of is and sort of isn't. It feels like an earthquake. What's happening? I really look like I know. Your judgment must be severely impaired. Which there really isn't, but there is a DLC that kind of does explain what happened to Alice as a younger child uh, for this game. But, with that being said, unfortunately the Steam version of this game does not uh, allow you to play or does not hold such, uh, does not hold such a DLC. So, when we finish, when I finish, or when we finish this game... Uh, you know, I'll probably finish this before you finish watching the whole playthrough. I will probably, most likely, wait, did I skip something? Yeah, most likely play this game, the DLC for this game, after beating this game. Because what I have known that this game had a DLC like that, I would have played it first because it's like a prequel, and I do like following the order. But with, but because I can't. Oh, there's a thing up there? No. Oh, there's a thing up there. How did I not see that? So let's use our Octogon. Oh yeah, that looks cool. It's like shooting green stuff. But like I was saying, when this game is over, play the DLC. I would have played it, would I have known that it existed, and would I have known that it was a prequel. But now that I do know, we'll play that after this. And I probably bet it won't be that long. This game is pretty long, so... You know, we're still in chapter one out of like six, eight chapters, I want to say. So, you know, we've been playing for, or at least I've been playing for a couple of hours, I want to say, give or take. And it looks like we're nowhere near uh, getting to chapter two. Or at least I don't think we are. So what do I do here? I go down. Okay. So there's a lot of stuff there. Put a bomb here. Oh, okay. Yeah, shrinking down helps you a lot. So the cleaver does give you a attack bonus, and the gun does give you an attack bonus as well. I think it gives more ammo, and this more power? I don't know. Don't quote me on that. I do know that the gun gives you more ammo, and that the... But I'm not sure what the cleaver does. What was that? That was like a weird hand motion. Out of the Hatter's, uh, I don't know, movements. But yeah, we got the same hats, if you could tell. I'm pretty sure they're the same. Whoa. Yeah, they look pretty similar. If not, they look pretty similar, like I said, and that looks pretty cool. Hey, we got a cutscene? No way. So this might be actually chapter two that we're walking into. <gasps> really? What the hell did that... Did you see the train? It just went through some stuff. Like it literally went through things. It's going through things. Like it's just phasing on through things. What is going on? What was that? Like a train church? I found the source of the shaking. But are those two quaking? What are they up to? You're never <laughs> silly hatter and Alice. It's left. You're too the late. Insolence, <laughs> the arrogance, the execrable table manners. They are destroyers of Wonderland. Defilers, denuders, derangers, delightful. Is Did they actually create that infernal train to destroy Wonderland? What does that matter? They deserve to die. Ow! 
Okay. Wait, can I have the Hatter's help? I don't want to fight without the Hatter's help. Oh, no. What is gonna come up from there? I actually don't know. Okay. Who is this? I don't even know who the rat is. Like, I know who the uh, the rabbit is, but I don't know who the mouse is. Okay. Don't be surprised to me dying a couple of times here. Just don't. Or not? What? What? All I really wanted was another tea party. Please, Hatter, you promised. Where is that train going? What's its purpose? Tell me. Now. There's no time for whatever it is you want to talk about. It's time for tea. Talk treats with Turkey. He ran the looking glass line. <clears throat> Come on, you lot. We can still be friends. I've got a fine Darjeeling. Drink, drink. <laughs> My memories are shattered. I'm trying to collect the pieces, and I now believe the train impedes me. You must help me. You promised. Ask the one who helps them what helps themselves, whoever that is. Ah! Very pick. He deserved to die. And I'm about to drown in tea in ignorance. That really just happened? Like, that really just... <laughs> I really can't believe that just happened. Not only did the mouse and rat die, uh, rabbit die, I keep saying rat, and uh, they died in such a bizarre way, but the matter was going crazy and trying to force feed them tea, and then he dies. Uh, okay. Not what I was expecting at all. I was like, oh, a boss fight, okay, this is gonna be fun. No, dead. Hatter's dead. Everyone's dead. What? Caught me very own ribbon then. Saints be praised that he works in mysterious ways and got plans for her. Take her over to the mangled mermaid. Rent a bed. On to woo a girl, Mr. Brawl. Do you think you're doing? What comes natural like? Not natural to me. Get away. Okay, can I move now? Okay, so it looks like, uh... Thanks for saving me, by the way. You could have said that, at least, Alice. But it looks like we're back to the White real world. Reminds me of my snowdrop. Nanny knew her. So I guess we're going to follow the white cap, but I'm just going to look around and see if uh, we can find anything. But yeah, it looks like we're back to the real world, which is like some type of London, England type of... I don't know, that's what it looks like to me, at least. But I still can't believe... What was that? Uh, eyes can reflect an... M Eyes can reflect an image if I could read, and like amber, trap to preserve a thing forever until it melts. Okay, why do I need to know that? Is there any combat that I really have to go through in the whole? What is that? That I have to go through in uh this game? Not this game, of course I do, but this world, this part of the game, I guess. So let's see. A toy must be completely ruined to abandon their children play jacks with pebbles. To abandon children where children play jacks with pebbles and only pretend to have a ball. Huh, I guess so. But man, is it really raining? It's like a bad day. Okay, so there's the mangled mermaid. I guess that's a bar, which is uh, what it looks to me. Yeah, where are we? We're like at the docks. What was they doing in the water? Alice is literally losing her mind. Uh, I haven't seen that cat for a while. So I'm not sure if I'm supposed to go in the Mangled Mermaid or not, but I'm going to assume so. But I do kind of want to discover or explore back there. Oh. Get those fat ass whores out on the street or I'll come up and brain you. Shut off your fucking snipe. You'll never get past Long Tim. I'll get what you and your floozies owe me, Miss Ladybird. See if I don't. Maybe you notice I'm not pissing me drawers at the prospect. 
Alice Little. You'll make a nice change. Bring your disheveled self up here. I mean, do I have to? Looks like she wants to put me to work, and I'm not really the person that wants to be in that type of work. I mean, you can do what you want, no matter what you want to do, you know? As long as it makes you happy, you're not hurting anyone. But I don't think Alice is really into that. Or maybe she is. I guess we're going to figure it out uh, next time with uh, going in here. Actually, I'm going to go in here. I'm going to check what's in here. I heard once Tim said he'd like to die from a social disease. Poor man never dreamed it's named was its name was Jack Splatter. I don't know what that means. Jack Splatter. Is that alcohol or something? But yeah, we're going to get out of the rain and then we're going to end it up here. Next time we're going to figure out what that lady wants with Alice and what is she doing back in the real world. And man, she looks sleepy. And um, see what happens next time with Wonderland if we go back and what we're going to do there. But that'll be for us. That'll be but that'll be it for us right now. So thank you for watching. If you enjoyed the video, please leave a like, a favorite, a comment, subscribe to the channel, and I'll see you guys next time.